Progressive Congress. Uh, some uh, three hours ago, we got an information from our situation room that uh, the governor of uh, Edo State, Mr. Godwin Obaseki, uh, came to INEC office and uh, was surprised. We even saw I mean, the picture I mean, going viral. So on that basis, we came here to seek to know why he's here. Because as far as we are concerned as a political party, a governor or anybody holding executive position cannot even serve as an agent of a political party. He is not on the ballot. He's not an agent of a political party. He's not an official of a political party like myself. So as far as we are concerned, his motive and intention here is suspect. So we believe that there might be an attempt to subvert the ongoing democratic process in uh, uh, those states. And uh, of course, uh, when we try to come within around for close to two hours, the police also, I mean, the police also entry. But I just spoke with the DIG now, and they assured us that in a matter of minutes, uh, Mr. Obaseki, I mean, will take exit of here. And we think that this is gross abuse of power, gross abuse of office, and unbecoming of somebody holding a very sensitive position as the governor of the state. Democracy has its own rules. Even if you have complaints about election, coalition is yet to be done. Coalition was adjourned to a level tomorrow. You have a state agent who can raise any observation that you have at the coalition level. There is also judicial process for you to facilitate and make differences. What Mr. Vaseki is doing is self help and self help can only lead to lawlessness. If not for the fact that we restrain our supporters, who almost about 1,000 of them are outside I mean, the gate, already clamoring that it should be ejected from these premises, but we have to plead on them that we need to maintain law and order. So we want to enjoy the security operative to ensure that they abide by the law. Yes, he should not abuse his privilege of having I mean, immunity to seek to harass, intimidate, or compromise the electoral I mean, process in the two states. We believe that uh, the process, uh, the APC agent was also chased out I mean, from the INEC office when Mr. Baseki I mean, came. We don't want to believe that INEC I mean, is compromised, but I think uh, the uh, attempt and uh, the suspicion is already there. And uh, when you are acting as umpire, you must be seen I mean, to be fair to all concerned. And in any event, uh, as a matter of law, uh, the Mr. Baseki's attitude here is, I mean, for his, his, his own becoming of somebody who is holding Sorry. that safety Sorry. position as the chief security officer. It's like, uh, with respect to his office, somebody liking, uh, like a tout. I mean, uh, his, like his attitude. Uh, with respect to his office, I, I am, I'm sorry that I use that word, but that is what it seems to any reasonable person. It's after five already. You're perhaps not worried that <laughs> announcement of results have not even started. Yet. No, coalition, coalition have been done at the uh, world level. Coalition, the results have been announced. As at uh, the last count, I mean, more than 96% uh, of the results have been uploaded, and the coalition have been done at local level. What we announcement that was made was that the coalition at the local or at the state level will commence at 11 a.m. tomorrow. It's not on tour today. 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 Yeah. today. So it's now today, you know, because we have not slept for the past three days, so maybe I lost count of uh, I mean, day. So today, 10, uh, 11 a.m. collation, I mean, because there's no problem about collation. But what we also, I mean, found very uh, on toward was that uh, just, I mean, uh, less than an hour uh, of close of four in some units, and even when election was still ongoing, I mean, one political party that uh, is the party of uh, Mr. Baseki purportedly brought out the result of 2020 election as their own I mean, result. That uh, uh, had it's to come and debunk I mean, that rumor. I think that show a propensity to seek to uh, compromise the electoral program. Maybe it is a continuation of that attempt that he has left his uh, dignified office, his very comfortable I mean, government house to come and uh, sit. I mean, uh, and they seek to harass and intimidate uh, the resident electoral commissioner and other uh, officers of uh, uh, ANEC. If so, the governor doesn't leave anytime soon, what will your party do? You see, uh, we believe that uh, he must leave. But if he does not leave, then uh, uh, the necessary legal position I mean, will be taken against him. I won't say more than that. Oh, thank you. Very thank much. you. <laughs>